March 13th, 2018, market gives us an incredible opportunity, a classic example of a reversal. In other words, when the stocks open higher one last time, they make a leap forward. And as they do that, they finally reverse it. As you can see, some of the strongest stocks are reversing right now. For example, Google opened up at 1180 this morning, now trading at 1146. The idea behind opening your short positions in the morning, when you're expecting the reversal, which we have been talking for the last few days on our channel, that the market has a possibility of creating a double top. When you're trading weekly options, opportunities like this, this reversal opportunities, uh, are literally opportunities that give you percentage returns of three, four, five hundred percent. For example, when Google was trading at 1180 this morning, the put options on your uh, 1160 puts for this week were priced around seventy dollars. Um, look at where they are priced today. Uh, right now, they're priced at about uh, $25, $25. So that was a quick 300% return if you would have caught this trend. Now, since we've been expecting this trend, um, and particularly we're expecting the trend reversal in some of the uh, technology stocks, some of your FANG stocks like Google, Amazon, um, Amazon is uh, clearly have uh, the same trend. Actually, all the FANG stocks have the same trend today. Amazon opened at 1617. It's trading down at 1578 right now. So this was a huge reversal opportunity in any FANG stock. If we take, for example, uh, Netflix, same thing. It's funny because Andrew Leff was talking on CNBC yesterday. Of course, this market moved lower. This reversal is working out in his favor, but he made a call before any, any of that was happening, and, and Netflix is trading much lower today. Also, we're noticing that is the same pattern in a lot of the Chinese stocks, like uh, BABA, which is Alibaba. Um, we were opening positions yesterday here around the 194 level. It's currently trading at 187. Um, NTS uh, opened at 317, currently at 307. And the whole idea here, this is the first day of the market reversal. So all of these stocks, they have a chance to go significantly, significantly lower by the end of the week or by next week. So let's take a, 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 a look here at what we're discussing in the S&P just a few days ago that possibly as S&P makes a move here, or we're actually discussing a level of 28.25, that it has a chance of stop in there maybe pausing for a second and making a reversal lower after that which technically would be considered a double top uh, we're discussing double top where it does not necessarily have to reach the ultimate level where it was traded in january at 28 50 28 75 range it may get pretty close to it, it may never actually get to the point where it was traded in january so we may have just a double top where this stop is going to be slightly lower than the top before so the idea here is if this is the first day lower as we're observing right now in FANG stocks like Google and the technology sector has been on a solid solid run over the last 10 days and in our prior videos we were discussing some of these reversal patterns such as the double top, the head and shoulders and another interesting pattern which we call a loss of momentum. So as the momentum continued significantly here in the example of Google for the last 10 days, it looks like this is your first day down. So typically we would expect if the trend was to continue for it to slide lower from the current level of 1147 and trend possibly all the way to this blue line. Now there is a chance which is at 11.15. Now there is a chance it will retest this level of 10.60 and that could happen in the next 72 hours to possibly going into next week. Now this creates an awesome opportunity to open some short positions. It creates an awesome opportunity to buy some puts um, because again we were expecting this reversal to happen um, it was kind of hard to time whether it was going to do it at this point here, at this point here. Uh, but I think today we're finally clear seeing some signals that this is the reversal opportunity. As you can see some of the indicators pointing out as it tries to go higher, 
uh, your RSI is definitely nowhere near as high as it was in the prior level. Um, and, and uh, you know, we're, we're clearly seeing that uh, it's NASDAQ in particular that's making a move lower. In other words, if we pull up any any technology stock, any FANG stock, they're all dropping today. Of course, the graph looks a lot better on Amazon, but nonetheless, it, Amazon had a substantial run from this 1280 range all the way to $1,617. And clearly, as it moves higher, we're seeing the same divergence on the RSI um, compared to where the stock was trading at 1500 level. Your RSI was at 90. Now it's moving higher to a much higher price range of 1617 this morning, but the RSI is falling lower. Um, now, if we analyze any other FIN stock, uh, you know, including Netflix. And uh, Apple also appearing to be topping out as well. So Netflix clearly, after a substantial run, it is making a, a move lower. It was falling yesterday. It's continuing the trend today. So it looks like Andrew Left's prediction that it could retrace back to 300 could become a definite reality uh, over the next 48 hours. Again, these market reversal opportunities, they're hard to time. But once you see the market making a on the first day down is what we're observing today, your first day down, um, particularly on uh, the technology sector that had substantial returns. Uh, this is a great, great time to place positions. In terms of trading weekly options, you can buy weekly options for this week or the following week, um, counting that the trend will continue. And if it does, really all you need to have substantial returns of three, four, five hundred percent is for the trend to simply continue for the next uh, three days. So here's here's your uh, NASDAQ after a substantial run from 7100 all the way to 7600 this morning. It's now retracing back and uh, this trend can clearly continue all the way back to the 7200 level and if it does Clearly, all your FANG stocks, as good as they are, uh, they're destined to fall. Your Google, your Amazon, uh, BKNG, as far as the price line, it really, and, 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 and it is a strong stock, and it had some really good earnings, but again, and now with very good stocks fall too, and this is just uh, the right opportunity uh, for them to make a pullback. So maybe in case of BKNG, maybe a pullback right here to the 2100 level. That's a drop of $79, creates a great opportunity to uh, have a three or four hundred percent return from the standpoint of trading weekly options. If you'd like to know more about uh, how you can take advantage of the market fall, simply visit uh, marketcrash.money. Um, if you need, if you're unexperienced with options or you, you'd like to put a, a solid option strategy that would take advantage of the market fall, which could be taking place here over the next few weeks. Um, just uh, visit marketcrash.money, hit right here the how to profit button, schedule a consultation. We'll get you going. Uh, we'll get everything explained to you, how the option strategy works, how to put one on. Uh, we'll walk you through placing your first trade. We'll show you exactly how everything works and the logic and reasoning and the charts behind it and, uh, and basically get you get you going in the right direction. So don't take, don't let the market take advantage of you in this upcoming market crash. Uh, the time to act right now, open your positions, open your short positions and take advantage over what appears to be a definite market fall over the next few days. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next video.